Hello again and welcome to another video from me Mr Arnold. In this video we're going to be focusing on constructing triangles when given two sides and one angle or SAS side and angle and another side. And in this question we're asked to construct a triangle with an angle of 40 degrees and sides of length 7.5 centimeters and 6 centimeters. So we're going to start by taking a ruler. So let's get a ruler. Now I'll make it a little bit bigger for you guys so you can see what's going on. And I want to measure a line that's either 7.5 centimeters or 6 centimeters long. It does not matter which one you choose to start with. Just for the purposes of this video, I'm going to choose 7.5 centimeters. So I'm going to draw a line that's 7.5 centimeters in length. So it goes from 0 right the way up to 7.5 centimeters in length. Just move away my ruler for a second and I'm going to label my line 7.5 centimeters. Okay, that's step one done. So I already have completed this line that's 7.5 centimeters in length. Next thing I need to do, and it's crucially important that we do this step next, is I need to mark an angle that's 40 degrees or whatever angle you're given in the question. So I need to mark that angle. Now, Let's just remove the ruler for a second so that we can clearly see what we're doing and take our protractor. And it doesn't matter which side you go to. If I go to this side and put my protractor down, I must measure from zero right the way around to 40 and put a mark. Or if I come over to this side, again, it's important that I measure from zero around to 40. I'm going to start with the left hand side. So I'm going to start over here and I want to measure an angle that's 40 degrees and put a little mark there. So I measure from 0 right the way around to 40 and I put a little mark. That is step 2 and then we get rid of our protractor, we don't need that anymore. The last thing we have to do is I now need, I need a line that's 6 centimeters long and it's going to go through this point here so we got to take our ruler out again let's take the ruler out make sure I'm going to make sure first of all that the ruler is the, the same length that it was earlier otherwise it won't look right um, a bit more. obviously your ruler at home doesn't change size so you won't have a problem all right, that's about right. So I have my ruler, it's the same scale as this, so. And now I need to draw the line that goes from here through this point and it needs to be six point f or six centimeters in length. So take my ruler, line it up, and I'm gonna swing it around. And I wanna swing it around so that it's lined up directly with this mark that we've made earlier. And then what I do is I make sure that I draw a line from here and it's going to be six centimeters long. Okay, it needs to be exactly six centimeters long. If it's not, we haven't done it correctly. Okay, it needs to be exactly six centimeters long, which my line is six centimeters long. I'm going to label it six centimeters and I can label my angle now as well. This was an angle that was 40 degrees. And we're almost done now. Last step is to use a ruler and just draw the remaining part of your triangle. There's no actual measurement required here because the three pieces of information we've given have made our triangle. So I'm just use black and connect up the rest of our triangle and we have now completed the problem we've, we've, we've constructed a triangle that that is 40 degree has a 40 degree angle has a side that's 6.5 centimeters in length and a side that's six centimeters in length and that is how you construct a triangle when given SAS any questions please leave a post and uh, we'll see you again sometime thank you